Well, this weekend is a Class B basketball bonanza. The Hoopster Classic underway in Minot, and we start with the ranked matchup, Beulah and Rugby taking on each other in a first quarter action. We go to Rugby's Trace Golvin driving in and hitting a nice contested floater. The Panthers on the board, but back comes Beulah when Jonah Larson takes a pass, laying it in, plus the foul, but Rugby gets the 64-49 to win. Moving to the other ranked matchup of the day, Shiloh Christian in Langdon area, Edmore, Munich. Shiloh getting on the board first when Trey Brunel takes the pass, draining it in the corner. But game tied at 52 with 5.8 seconds left on the clock. Langdon's going to inbound, but it's going to be stolen by Shiloh when Carter Anglin going to lay it in with no time left. Buzzer beater at the end. Skyhawks get the win 54-52. How about the eighth ranked Dickinson Trinity and the defending champs from last year, Thompson. First quarter action, Thompson getting on the board fast when Chance Danner puts the or powers the layup in. And then off the inbound, Trinity gonna get on the board when Tanner Soren gets the shot to go by the defender, ties the game up at that point. But it'll be the Titans taking this one 54-49. How about some of the earlier games of the day? Benson County taking on West Hope Newburgh. First quarter action off the steal. Benson County's Carter Tandeski takes the pass. They're going to lay it in for two. And then another steal for the Wildcats when Blaine Anderson laying it in as well. It was all Wildcats in this one. Benson County wins big 64-29. How about the Delax Burlington Lakers who are taking on the role of Bulldogs? First quarter action, Lakers, Jacob Burleson going to take the pass and get it off the board for two. Back comes Rolla when Mitchell Lease drains a three, three of his team leading 23 points on the afternoon, but it'd be too little too late. It would be Delax Burlington who would get the win 76-53.